after the war. And I'm playing the third movement of the second sonata. Um, it's in a very strange rhythm, actually a very Slavic rhythm, it's in seven eights. Um, and Richter premiered it because Prokofiev um, didn't play so well anymore. And Prokofiev was always very close, probably um, because of political reasons. He didn't really voice many opinions. But Richter thought that this um, third movement depicted the German tanks advancing on Moscow. And you can hear, actually when you, when you hear the second one, you can hear the, the rattle of the, of the iron, and you can hear the machine guns um, going. And it is quite um, effective. And Prokofiev won um, the Stalin Prize uh, for it, um, which was one of actually the highest mm -hmm. prize for the arts in the Soviet Union under Stalin. Mm -hmm. Oh, thank you. <coughs>
I remember seeing you play and you just flew out of your seat yes. at a certain so moment energetic. during it. It was mm. great. Have you learnt the whole of it? Yeah. Yeah. I heard Katia, what's her name, Bernard Tishvili, mm. play it um, just before Christmas and I thought it was amazing. It is an amazing. Yeah. I mean, I didn't know it before, um, but she, um, it was just, yeah, it's incredibly arresting. Yeah. And yeah. I first heard it the first, um, the first time. I didn't like it. I didn't like the first movement at all. And um, when my teacher suggested I should play it for the exam. I thought, oh, no. But then I um, bought the recording by Pellini, and the oh, more yeah. often I heard mm. it, yeah. mm. the more I did like the repetition. And well, it did, does something to your blood pressure, it really gets mm. going. Yeah. Well, it's relentless. That's yeah, what I love great. about it, and yeah. it stops.